I, I wanted to come out today and share a couple of things with the founding members of Unpassive. I'm Mike Ellis, by the way. Uh, if you understand these two things, you're going to know exactly where you're going to be in a couple of months. And I'm going to let you determine that at the end of the video. It's a very, very good place. Uh, but the first thing I want to talk about, it's probably the most powerful thing that I've ever heard in Unpassive. And as you look at Unpassive, I've heard a lot of really, really terrific things, Catmo and, and the things that Ash and Farah shared with us. But this one thing, I believe, for me, was the most powerful thing that I've heard talked about on Passive. And, and the first thing is, is a conversation that Ash had on one of his webinars with the founding members of OnPassive. And, and we know that Ash likes to come on and talk to the founding members, see where they're at, see, see how they're feeling, that type of thing. Uh, really, really cool. And Ash came on and he was talking to a young lady. And, and Ash Mufar, as we know, is very, very curious. If he weren't, we wouldn't have been able to go from the inception of, of OnPassive to where we are right now, Unicorn Company. Wouldn't have been able to do it. So we love Ash's curiosity. And Ash came on and asked this young lady a very, very uh, innocent, curious question. And he asked the young lady, what color is your country? Now, I'm not sure that can be asked anywhere else but in on passive because we are such a tight knit group uh, and we love the curiosity of Ash Mufara. But he asked the question, what color is your country? And the young lady came on and, and she said, you know, we have a saying in our country, and that saying is Tukala. And what it means is a country of many colors. And, and when she said that, for me, it was remarkable. It was extraordinary. And as she said that, it, it, just, it just flashed in my mind right away. That is unpassive. And it, it, it is the most powerful description that I've ever heard about Unpassive and the founding members of Unpassive, Tukala, uh, a company of many colors. And, and as she described it, I understood that when she talked about a country of many colors, no one color dominating another, all colors having tremendous value. And again, it just, it just entered my mind, that is Unpassive, we are Tukala. And when you look at OnPassive, we have people coming in from all over the globe, from every country, from every nation, every language, every color. And it's remarkable what Ash Mufar has put together, how it's come together, how it's mesh, meshed, how it's been grafted together. And as we look at the founding members of OnPassive and what we've become, as we start to move, as Ash Mufar starts to move us in, in whatever direction, we will be an unstoppable force. Now, Ash Mufar is always going to be at the rudder. He's always going to be, be, staring, be, be steering that, that, that massive luxury liner that's going to be coming into the world. He's always going to be there. We want that. We absolutely want that. But as we look at Unpassive, yes, the founding membership, Ash Mufara, it's part of this this powerful movement that we have. But the found, but the but the the tech team in Hyderabad, they're just as powerful. We need them too. They bring the products out. The products it, it's what fuels the founding members of Unpassive. And as we look forward, and Ash Mufara starts to move this 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 beautiful mass of individuals coming together and becoming one. As we start to move. It will be unstoppable. Nobody will be able to stop the momentum that we're going to bring forward in on passive. So as you look at on passive <clears throat> and you look at what Ash has done and what the founding members have done and what this, this one individual, one little world word is a perfect description of on passive Tukala. And this was an individual I'd never heard before. I'd never seen her before. It shows you the kind of talent we have in Unpassive. It shows you the wisdom that we have in Unpassive. And as we look at that, Unpassive is getting ready to change. How, how do I know that? How do I know that Unpassive uh, is in a place where, where it's just going to change? And I want to give you a couple examples of that. Uh, today, because of the, the amount of people we have in Unpassive, we have a lot of new members coming out and becoming leaders of Unpassive. And that's a really, really good thing. And the old guard is starting to fade away. Now the old guard will never fade away completely, 
but we have new talent coming in. Most of the time, they're better than the old guard. Uh, and you can see it, whether it's uh, Robin Williams or Chris Johnson, whether it's uh, Julian Milo, whether it's Ron uh, and Lynn, whether it's uh, Engineer Mike or Engineer Bob, whether it's Comfort, Comfort coming in and, and starting to take the reins and, and keep the founding members of On Passive not only informed but engaged. Uh, and I see that happening today. And, 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 and by the way, this is a really, really good thing. We need so many good leaders because on passive is so big and it's not going to get any smaller guys. So we need really good quality leaders coming in and taking the reins and, and keeping on passive fresh and moving forward and engaged. So this is a really, really good thing. And, and I know that I'll give you an example of how I know that um, on passive nation has a YouTube channel. Okay. We've had it for, for three years. That YouTube channel is no longer ours. It is no longer on Passive Nation. It is on Passive. This is a good thing, by the way. And when I look at that YouTube channel, there is more content, more videos from the founding members of on Passive than there is from on Passive Nation. Again, this is a good thing. And this is how on Passive is, is changing today. The old guard passing away, new talent coming up. Uh, and it keeps on passive vibrant and young and healthy. Uh, this is what on this is what Ash Bufar wants. He wants on passive to continue to grow, uh, to evolve into something that's better and better and better. Uh, and I see that happening before my eyes with all the new talent coming on, uh, with what everybody is doing, and how Ash Mufara is is guiding this magnificent ship moving forward uh, into the global launch of on, on passive. So Tukula, I believe, is one of the most powerful things that I've ever heard in on passive. And it wasn't said by Ash Mufara, but one of the founding members. Uh, I thought it was absolutely awesome, uh, remarkable. Uh, all those acronyms that you can use, uh, it really does describe who we are in on passive. So that's number one. Let's go to number two. Um, Ash Mufar, about two days ago, did a, a web. He didn't do the webinar, but he came on and talked in the webinar. And the, the title of the webinar was uh, Targeted Traffic. Uh, people were going to come on, talk about targeted traffic, marketing, how it works, how it's going to benefit you. Uh, and Ash Mufar could not <laughs> resist himself. He had to come on because this is his passion. He loves marketing. He loves tra targeted traffic. This is what he does. This is his passion. And when he came on, did you hear that passion? I mean, he talked about everything, how, how all these, these intricate things uh, come together and, 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 and build a, a marketing campaign, how it goes out, how the target traffic comes in, goes out, how customers come in, everything that you could think about. Uh, when it comes to targeting traffic and marketing, Ash Mufara talked about it. Uh, it was cool. It was very, very cool. And, and, and marketing is one of my passions. Uh, and as, as Ash talked about it, I know most of the people there couldn't put all the, all the dots together. They, I mean, it was so complicated, but they understood what Ash was talking about. And as this comes together, how, how really uh, powerful it's going to be for the founding members of OnPassive. Now, when I listened to Ash, I loved it all, by the way. I absolutely loved it all, uh, and I learned a lot. But the one thing that, that really stood out for me, because it impacts all of us, it impacts, it, it impacts all the founding members of Unpassive, he talked about uh, his conversion rate. <clears throat> now, initially he came on and, and he said, you know, co conversion rates, in other words, um, customers seeing what you have and buying. That's it. How many? And that's the conversion rate. If you have 100 customers and 50 buy, that's a 50% conversion rate. Simple as that. How many customers are buying? That's all it is. And he said it's really, really difficult to talk about conversion rates because there are so many variables involved, which we had just heard. Uh, it's really, really hard to say what a conversion rate is going to be. But he did talk about it. Now, personally, myself, if I get a five or six, if I get a five percent conversion rate, in other words, five or six percent of the customers coming in and buying, I can build a six-figure income, maybe a seven-figure income. Gives you an idea of the numbers involved. But Ash came on and he, he, he wouldn't talk specifically about the conversion rate that he thought 
his marketing campaigns were going to get for us, the amount of customers coming in and buying. But he did talk about his past history, and he talked about a conversion rate of 50%. Now, when, when he talked about very, very low conversion rates, three, four, five, six percent. He just poo-pooed those. He goes, no, 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 we, we don't even go there. But when he started to talk about his experience and what he's done, he said, yeah, we've, we've had conversion rates of, of 50 percent. Um, very, very good. We've also had a conversion rate uh, with particular marketing campaigns of 100 percent. Now, when you start to think about these conversion rates, and again, we don't know what they're going to be as Ash does the marketing campaigns, but based on his bat, based on his past experience, if they're 35, 40, 45, 50, that is massive. And what they will do for those individuals that are founding members of Unpassive, those individuals participating with Unpassive, the numbers that Ash used, if he only gets close to those, it'll blow your socks off. You will be in that place. Yes, you can You can develop an income, you can de develop residual income, and you can de develop wealth online. Um, and if he comes close to those conversion rates, and knowing Ash, he's, he's probably, <laughs> he's probably going to exceed those. It's just who he is. But he knows the, 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 um, the value of, of the traffic that's going to be coming in. He knows how qualified they're going to be. He knows how good they're going to be. He knows they're looking for what we have. And over time, I believe that conversion rate will be very, very high. These people will come in and buy the products of Unpassive. Why? Product, superior, lower price point. And Ash Mufar knows how to get these products in front of people in a very, very good way so that as they look at them, they're just going to go, oh, I have to have that. So, that was that was something Ash Mufara talked about. I, I thought the conversion rates were very, very uh, exciting for all the founding members in on passive. And if you understand conversion rates, if you if you're getting 25, 30, 35, 40 percent of the customers coming in and buying, guys, you don't have anything to worry about. On passive is going to take off like a rocket and and you're going to be able to sit back and watch those apples come in and change your life. So those are the two things I wanted to share with you. Hope, hopefully, uh, hopefully you enjoyed them. Uh, I know the conversion rate you did, but Tukala, it's just one of those things. It's one of those tangibles that someone uh, in the in the Unpassive family came in and shared with us. I just thought it was very, very powerful. So that's it for today, guys. I, I hope you all have a great week. Uh, keep your eyes uh, glued on Unpassive. Things are going to be changing very, very quickly now. And as they do, I'll come on and do more videos. If you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, go on down there, subscribe, click the bell on the right, and you'll get notifications as I do more videos. But we're putting a lot of videos up on, on this channel right now. It is an unpassive YouTube channel right now, and there's a lot of information that here that will help each and every one of you. Uh, so from there, just, just stay engaged, guys. It's, it's happening. It's happening right before our eyes. And from there, yeah, we're just going to see everybody at the top. Have a great week. And we'll uh, we'll chat soon. Bye.